And here we go, grand final set, ace combat first. Liquid and Knuckle Dude. Now, because Ace Combat is sitting pretty in winner's side, Knuckle Dude has to win two sets of three out of five in order to take this tournament. Ace just has to win one set. I mean, Ace has had an amazing run. You can't say anything like this guy got a easy bracket. I mean, let's just go over the facts here. Ace Combat has taken out in winners Sonic Fox. Shine, Smug, Vagabond to get to Grand Finals. This guy has had to fight everybody. And wake up like Hiktasu, nice tech here to seal the round, first round. And just like that, as you were talking about all the people he's killed, he's trying to dish out the same justice to Knuckle Doom. Letting people know that this is his house. Ooh. Knuckle Dew attempting to punish the with target combo there, but instead he's gonna get countered on his own. Yep. What? Kind of a premature DP across the screen. Well, Knuckle Dew is just using those sonic booms to just check him in a neutral. Oh wow! The one fireball that connects, Ace was already ready to cancel into V Trigger. Oh wow! And Ace Combat takes game number one over Team Liquid's Knuckle Do. Ace Combat is not having it. Ken has been terrorizing not only the North North America, has been terrorizing people globally as Momochi just won Stunfest. Ace is showing that he got that work. Round one. Ace is definitely right. trying to prove that he is the next Undiscovered Champion here in the PXG Online Championships season finale. Nice slow in the crouching short, crouching jab, DP. Corner pressure here on the verge of stun. Goes for another throw. Going to keep Nash on the ground. Uses the EX Fireball to keep the pressure going. One more hit. And Nash is going to back away. Yep. And Ace is like, you know what? It's over with. I can't get the stun. Next time I get a series, he's dead. That nice is punishable. Punish knuckle, Knuckle Dude is going to back out and try to zone here. Ooh, nice walk back a little forward. Yeah. And Knuckle Dude completely slows down the pace of this match. Just keeps Ace at bay. He's going to play more of his game. And just nice like that, he tries to jump in. House. Both players oh attempting God. to challenge each other, but Ace Combat's button coming out. Ooh, he tries to follow up against the V-Trigger. Or the V-Reversal out. You know, Ace realizing that that wasn't that that sidekick wasn't punishable at that particular range, but took advantage of the the negative frames that that was and dashed in just to close space. Oh, so good from Knuckle Do. Ace just needs one hit; he can seal this round. No anti airs at all here. And Knuckle Do kept going low because he had no reason to go for anything else. Because you know, people are gonna anticipate the overhead. So just keep checking him low. Nash and Knuckle Dude showing that trying like he's tournament proven. Knuckle Dude so has this... to win two more just to reset the bracket, and then he has to win another three. Because he's coming yep. from loser's bracket. Now all Ace needs to do is seal two more games, and this tournament is his. He's walking away with two hundred dollars at absolutely no financial commitment here. I mean all he had to do was just show up. Round one. And so we'll see. Fight. He's been getting caught by a lot of that. Just like that, and Knuckle Dude is completely controlling this match.
Yeah, it, look, it doesn't look like Ace has an answer for that. And just like that, you gotta be careful if you're chucking Plasma at Nash and he has V-Trigger. Because he can, on reaction, punish you on the other side. Are we seeing a, an adjustment here from Knuckle Dude? Absolutely are. He's definitely uh, taking control of this match. Ace Combat attempting to anti-air the cross up there, but it completely whiffs. Tries to punish with the three-frame light kick Tatsu. Uh, I, I definitely like what I saw there. Oh, uh, and I think Knuckle Dude, Knuckle Dude picked up on it instantly. Ace started pressing buttons after the pressure because he was anticipating no sickle kicks. And Knuckle Dude was like, you know what? I'm ready for that. Oh, nice reset, but he's just gonna go to the crouching jab just to check Knuckle Dude to get the throw. That is so tricky. Yeah, unable to block. That is a mix up full screen. Did this he catch him? Oh, no, what? He could have done so out. much more damage. Almost probably he sealing the round. He was out of range. I mean, he was out of, uh, yeah, he was out of range. Was he? Okay. Yeah, he was out of range. Oh! And a double KO, and unfortunately, that's gonna go in Knuckle Deuce's favor. He's gonna take game number two, bringing it to 2 1, one game away from resetting the bracket here in grand finals. Wow. And he was out of range. Once he got the confirm off the crouch medium, can crouch medium punch cancel and the V trigger, he was out of range for the back, uh, back strong into the target combo. Into I want to see the chat's predictions. Type one if you think Knuckle Dude's going to take this set. Type two if Ace Combat's going to win. Nice block on the Tatsu cross up from Knuckle Dude. He's only one for that one time this entire set, and he actually caught him. Big damage. He just can't really catch a break oh, here. Oh, wow. Knuckle Dude really adjusting here. I mean, he has just been controlling the pace since the first game. Round two. Fight. Okay, Ace definitely has to figure something out in the neutral. Just like that. He's just... Okay, good confirm right there. Cross of course, over. after that same reset we saw earlier, uh, where he, you know, Ace actually landed the same reset. I'm surprised Dude didn't adjust to that because he he went on the same side after the, the run under. I think the mentality behind that is he would stay in front to keep him in the corner, so that's probably why he blocked in the front. You know, even though Knuckle Dude has kind of taken control of the fight, it's been extremely close. Ace Combat has definitely not been any kind of slouch. Like, these games have been extremely close, very impressive. Nice anti-air DP from Ace Combat. Staying alive here, trying to stop Knuckle Dude from resetting this bracket. He does not want to have to go through another set. If he wins one more, he just needs to one, win one more game. No cancel into critical, all right? Nice anti-air with the X, making sure it hits. Ace with the pressure here. Gets stuffed out of the fireball. Oh, and he almost neutralized. All right, here, nice crush counter on the roundhouse. And he's going to get a fireball on his wake-up point, Blake, leaving himself open. This is not looking good for Ace. Nice. No anti-air from Knuckle Dew. Big damage. Corner situation here. And he's going to take it. <laughs> Ace combat with the aggression. In a now, surprise, explosive manner, takes that game, steals it. He literally steals that game away from Knuckle Dude. You know, unfortunately, Knuckle Dude did attempt to punish the target combo there. But that's where he got counter hit, and that's how Ace was Round able to one. take it. It is such a tight punish. It is very unfortunate that he was not able to get that punish out. Ace on the verge of taking this tournament and being $200 richer. Knuckle Dude turning it up here. He does not want to go home. Oh, and he misses the cross up opportunity and gets thrown into the corner. Uh, but that's fine. He puts Ace right back in the corner. Oh, wow. And Ace actually woke up with it. The one time he woke up with it, but it was kind of those situations where you almost expect it. But he gets the cancel into V Trigger. 
Oh, that was dangerous. Oh Big my damage. god. No, Knuckle Dude actually took the hit. Well, I like what I saw. He 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 in his mind had the throw in in his mind within the mix-up because he went for the the neutral jump light kick, which of course has different like uh, block stun. And you have to just like that, every single situation where Ace died in those close situations, Nash had a V trigger and he didn't pay attention to it, and just ate and just kept throwing fireballs. Okay, nice confirm from Knuckle Do on his wake up. Nice sweep gets the knockdown, goes for the throw. Nice sweep. Back in the corner. This is not where Nash wants to be. This is where Ace has been able to get most of his work in. Attempts to go oh. for the anti-air, but unfortunately gets tagged. Knuckle Dude is going to back up, throw fireballs, try to just create a little bit of space here and breathe. Ace not letting him have it. Jumping in, he's going to get the crush counter stand around, house into the run combo. This is bad, he's going to go for the overhead, but Dude is not going to use the critical art. Stand I think jab. Knuckle Doo was thinking about the next round because the critical art wasn't going to kill and that wasn't a sure oh, wow. victory for him. So he wanted to see if he could create another situation and get it. Ooh, and just like that. And it paid off for him. He's going to get an extremely art. strong lively here, but he's going to be left with no meter for the rest of this. Ooh, whiffs the throw of both players. Again, another whiff. Knuckle Doo turning it up. Ace combat with his back against the wall, trying to throw, create space with fireballs. Oh, nice like dash and throw. Big damage. Use the B trigger. Takes him in the corner. Smart play. Oh, nice block of the overhead. He's gonna oh. get it. Ken not leaving off. He's going in. He's going in, and he's gonna oh. take it. Nice takes it over Team Liquid Knuckle Dude, applying Can't the pressure wait. to close things out. And oh my god, Ace Combat takes PXG Online Championship Season 